hello everyone welcome to my channel this is harika so in today's video i am going to tell about one of the new initiatives that i've come up with uh, which is the new playlist that i'm going to start that's on microsoft azure ai services so this is something that i recently started learning so i'm going to start this uh, series with all the learnings that i have done and also going forward whatever i come across any use cases or i do any of uh, the research uh, then definitely I will be putting up over here so it's more like learning together and growing together yes so as a part of this series I have uh, divided this thing into multiple videos and I would try to make this a uh, few short videos instead of one single long video um, and also I have plan future plan for uh, making some other series on uh, not only on ai 900 content but also on ai 050 and ai 102 content so what uh, they will be and what is the differences and all i will be talking shortly but before to that what this particular series is and what you're going to learn after by the time you finish this particular playlist is something that I'm going to look into in depth and I'm going to share you all the details okay so firstly I have as I told you that I've divided uh, this as of now I'm having this plan like to divide this into AI 900 AI 050 and AI 102 okay so these are the different things that I'm going to divide like different playlists that I'm going to have and in AI 900 what you can learn by finishing the series of AI 900 is you will be going to learn first and the foremost the basic concepts okay so I will be teaching everything right from the scratch right from the very basics like what is Microsoft Azure AI services and how you can access the services what are the different types of services that are there in Microsoft and uh, what service you should use for performing certain tasks and which capability that particular task can be included in right so all these different things I'm going to talk and I'm going to show you the environment where you will do this and I'll kind of make you comfortable with the environment in this particular uh, video and after that I will show you how you can actually create a resource first of all what is a resource what are the prerequisites that you need to have in order to create a resource and how you can create one how to utilize that and what are the different things that are associated with resource so all of these things that I'm going to talk and I'm going to create a resource so along with you uh, in the video so that you can understand how you can also do it right and then I'm going to talk about the different studios. So we have different studios like Content Safety Studio. We have Language Studio. We have Speech Studio, Vision Studio, OpenAI Studio. So like that, we have different types of studios. So I have kept here a few, but there are a lot of studios, right? So I will be talking about all these different types of studios that we have on Azure AI. And what are the different capabilities that each studio comes up with? right and how can you utilize that capability in that particular studio you cannot directly go and utilize it right so you need to configure something so what is that configuration what you can utilize it and to utilize a particular capability what studio you have to go to how you can reach out to studio all of that I'm going to talk about in these particular videos I'm going to talk about all the different types of studios different capabilities how to configure that how to um, uh, you know utilize them uh, with the existing ones and also with your own data how you can uh, perform or test the studio functionality everything I'm going to show demo on this particular studios okay and uh, after that I will be showcasing like this is basically you know the basics of uh, AI 900 uh, all the different things that you need to know the different services that uh, will be provided and all of that right so I will be talking about everything in detail uh, uh, by the end of uh, AI 900 uh, series playlist, you would be able to, you will be having a clear idea. Okay. So now if you want to perform a certain use case, you would be able to understand what service you need, what resource you should create, right? There are different types of resources like single resource, single service resource, multi service resource. So uh, when to choose what, how to choose wisely, there will be few resources like, uh, pay as you go resources right so all these different different things that i'm going to talk about so by end of ai 900 you should be in a position that you know uh to uh to 
understand what are the different types of resources services that you have and which uh, resource or studio that you go to to pick it up and all of that right so that is something that ai 900 uh, talks about so if you go to ai 050 this talks about open ai services right so uh, as I go keep talking more technical uh, details in the next videos, you will understand. But here I'm just trying to keep it as much high level as possible because I'm going to give you brief of everything about it. And uh, before I start the series on AI 050, I will uh, just like this, I will put up the contents of what you're going to learn in AI 050 in each and every video. But on high level, what AI 050 will help you understand is if you wanted to develop a more model using the open AI capabilities like in open AI we have different models like GPT 3.5 GPT 4 like that we have different types of models right so you can use the custom data you can let a uh, you can create a chat bot right all these different types of uh, uh, services you can create by using open AI not just that till here if you see we have only created the service and we have utilized that in the playground but in AI 050 I will show you how you can do everything by using your own data right i told you the custom data how you can train the model with the custom data how you can um, uh, create a chat bot and how you can utilize this not only in the playground but how you can transfer this uh, capabilities by using all these resources and then uh, you know uh, the chat bot uh, everything into your code right into your visual studio code so for this basically we use visual studio code right so we will be utilizing this whole thing in ai 050 as a part of it and next coming back to ai 102 this is similar to a uh, azure open ai service like whatever we are doing I mean, not the service exactly, but whatever the steps that we're doing, like basically we are utilizing the resources and everything that we've created in our studio into our code, right? So we have developed everything, right? So here, what we will do in this particular series is we will be going to create all different types of services, right? We will be seeing how you can do the vision, uh, uh, how you can try to develop a vision service. Like there will be a lot of capabilities under vision service, right? Like you can extract the data, you can... Uh, using the OCR, you can do the image analysis, you can do the object detection, like that there are different types of capabilities that a Vision Studio can provide. So by, till now we were just using the playground, but how you can actually develop, design a model, right, by using the Visual Studio code is something that I'm going to tell you in the Azure AI solution, in the um, AI 102, right? So these are the things that we are going to learn in AI 102. So uh, that's why I'm telling AI 900 is very basic and most important module because you cannot understand, uh, you know, suddenly if I go ahead and tell you uh, to pick up the service for doing the OCR, how you will understand? You should know that you should use the Vision Studio or the service exactly related to that, right? So all those things you will learn in AI 900, which you will leverage them for building and designing the models in AI 102. So this is all interconnected. So AI 900 is the very most important uh, course that you need to know in order to understand the uh, or to design and implement the things in the Visual Studio code. So with that, I hope you got the idea about uh, AI 900, AI 050 and AI 102. So in this videos, in this particular series, I am going to talk about all of them in depth and try to give as much information as possible if i don't know any of the information i will redirect you to the links and also i will share you the code because everything is accessible through github right so with that let's get this video started and uh i hope i have i've got you the clear idea and also i also believe that you guys are equally excited as me uh let's get into the video uh i am going to talk about what is Microsoft Azure AI services in detail and let's see you there.